you just uh, real quickly state your name and where you're from? My name is Franklin. Uh, I'm a producer from Amsterdam, the Netherlands. Uh, I make music as FS Green, and I also go by the name Midas Hutch. Uh, yeah, I was born and raised in Amsterdam, yeah, still live there. A normal day on a Sunday, usually I play a lot of gigs, still every week. So usually I play on Saturday and on Sunday I'm just chilling. Amsterdam is a really small city, it's not even one million people there. And everything is super close by, so I drive my bike there. That's almost most places in my city I can either walk there or drive my bike. So the, the, the thing in Holland is it's a really... There's a lot of cultures in Holland, but especially in Amsterdam. So everybody, like all of my friends are from different places, like Caribbean, African, uh, Moroccan, Dutch. So I think first of all, the music sounds comes from growing up with all these different cultures and learning about music from all, all these different cultures. So that's why it's a really like a blend of a lot of different things. Obviously hip hop is really popular there, but uh, Afro beats it's, it's really what's popping right now and the dancehall stuff like that. So um, yeah, that's what, what you hear a lot of in my FS Green sets. Yeah. The DJs that I, that I um, look up to when I started DJing, they were all playing um, uh, like mix of hip hop, disco stuff, uh, Brazilian stuff, funk, funk stuff, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's hard to define what the sound is actually, but yeah, it's getting more and more popular. But this has been going on for some years now. I co-produced a song by Major Lazer, Watch Out For This, Bumaye, together with Flexigan. He's also a Dutch producer and DJ. The original Major Lazer song started off as a remix that me and Flexigan did. And we played it in class, put it on some mixtapes, and then Diplo heard it and he was like, oh, this is fire. Uh, want to put on a major laser album. So that's how that came about. It kind of started off as a fun side project called Midas Hutch uh, about three or four years ago when it was already been doing music as FS Green, but I wanted to, because I was playing so many different types of sounds as FS Green, and I really started to become a fan of uh, like 80s disco and R&B music, and I wanted to like build a project around that, so I started Midas Hutch, and I just did, just released my second EP uh, in September this year. I came here to Seoul for the first time exactly one year ago, uh, around the same time. And I started hearing all this, this music in bars and at restaurants that I couldn't really tell if it was American or not, but I just knew I really, I really liked it. And then I started shazamming and asking my Korean friends, like, yo, what is this music? And it was Korean rap and R&B. Uh, my first contact was at Soap. Uh, I came here the day before I played and I went to to soap to see uh, to see what the club was like, and off on off was performing, and it was the, the wildest stuff I ever saw because the music is really mellow, but the crowd was super hyped and screaming and taking pictures, and I was like, what what is this music? Who are these guys? And then they brought out Dean for the song that they did together, and yeah, the crowd just lost their minds, and I was like, yo, I need to know what what's this all about? Because this is just dope. Yes, yeah, I, I basically asked Paul and who I DJs with at Soap. They're like about some artists and they put me on to, to Hoodie, uh, Sick K, Crush, Grey, Loco, uh, who else I listen to, PH1. So Fallen's also linked me up with, uh, with a singer from here. 
and I sent her some beats and she sent me some tracks back. So there's some demos lying around, some collaborations with Korean artists that will hopefully be out soon.